What's up guys? So before the video begins, I'd like to thank the sponsor of today's video, Ewan Racing. You can actually get 25% off everything on the site by using my code slow or code slow plays. Just click my link down below, use my code and you can get a sweet discount. It's definitely been almost a couple of years since we got some new partner keys in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. In the next DLC pack 17 update, here are a few characters that I would like to see get some new updates. Yeah! All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays, and I am back at again with some more Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 DLC Pack 17 free update content here on the channel for some predictions, speculations, things that I personally will want to see, and I know a lot of you guys have been wanting to see. Hopefully, in the next update, I'm talking about whenever it actually drops with the full DLC, there is most likely going to be another free update with it. And again, we have no idea whenever this is dropping, but I really hope we get more custom partner keys. It's been way too long. It's been like, I feel like two or three DLCs since we got custom partners. I think the last one was like, I, I feel like it was DLC 14. I could be wrong, man. It's It's been a while. Okay, so um, a couple of the characters that I wanted to focus on are going to be more inspired by what we recently have in Dragon Ball Legends with the new tag SSBE Vegeta with Kaioken Blue Goku. Uh, I wanted to focus on a new version of Goku here. This one is so sick. So this is a battle damage Super Saiyan Blue Goku that can transform into Kaioken Blue. And I gave him a bunch of cool skills, uh, including the new Festival Spirit Bomb. I just want to see what happens, if anything will happen. Uh, we also have a new Vegeta, which is transforming. This one goes from SSB to SSBE with the evolved form. I uh, got a couple of weird custom skills on here that I thought would be fun. And we also will be doing, of course, my boy. My boy on Twitter said, I don't even know who it was. Somebody called him Breast Gohan. <laughs> Bet? Bet. Breast Gohan. So we got Breast Gohan here. Um, he's got heroic assault, like some crazy stuff. I want to see if father-son Kamehameha would work. I think that'd be sick. Imagine father-son Kamehameha with Beast Gohan. Like, I feel like that would pair together so well. So, let's go ahead and start off with the Blue Boys. Be sure to drop a like, subscribe here on the channel, and uh, ring my notification bell. And let me know down in the comments, what other custom partners do you want to see? I'll do some more showcases and videos on it. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right, guys, the Blue Boys. I want to see some of these weird skills that I gave him to see if they would even work. I feel like Vegeta might have some issues just because he's got some skills that he's really not supposed to have, but uh, I mean, they're not supposed to have like any of these, right? Uh, let's go ahead and go for the Spirit Blaster. I feel like that's just fitting for Goku. I don't know why, but I mean, we probably would never get it, but it just looks really nice. Like just being able to, it's just, it's, I mean, it's a basic thing. It's just a blue, you know, homing key blast type of move. Like it's, it's nothing too ridiculous. I feel like it would work pretty well, right? Uh, we also did Kaioken Kamehameha because, like I said, this is trying to... It's going to be more inspired by um, the Kaioken Blue from the Tournament of Power. This is more of, like, just the Tournament of Power Goku. That's what I'm trying to go for with this. You feel me? You smell what I'm cooking? So, I think that looks pretty cool. Uh, just seeing that nice glow on him and everything is just... It's just clean, dude. Um, and because it is, like I said, Tournament of Power inspired, I was like, oh, we'll give him a couple of uh, UI, UI Goku moves or whatever i think the spirit pulse actually looks sick i mean i know that is like an ultra instinct based type of shit or whatever but i mean he could still do it right <laughs> right maybe this is like post top like moro saga where it's like he knows some ultra instinct shit right uh spread shot retreat you know basic stuff nothing too crazy there um let's actually see dragon fist yeah dragon fist on super saiyan blue goku is so cool i hope we get to see that at some point unless he already did it and I'm just not remembering, but I want to see that. Like That's like main, like Super Saiyan 3 and Super Saiyan 4 Goku. We only see, usually those forms use like the Dragon Fist type of thing. I think God Goku did some kind of Dragon Fist thing or whatever, but I want to see like Blue Goku do it or like Ultra Instinct. Maybe that Silver God Flash or whatever it was, Silver Dragon Flash, that's that's supposed to be it. I don't know, man. Um, I just want to see Super Spirit Bomb Festival, okay? So this is backported from the new update. Um, I want to see, does he actually go Kaioken or not? Probably not. Let's see. Okay, yeah. So he just gets the gold aura, which is weird. But it still looks cool. I love the animation on that. Let me just see it one more time. Because, I mean, this is basically how it looks in, uh, you know, when he normally does it with Super Saiyan. But he's in blue this time around. That, that's so cool just seeing Spirit Mom on him. Like, honestly, this right here, it just reminds me of the Tournament of Power. Like, right before he went Ultra Instinct. Like, that's so cool, dude. Let me get it frame by frame here. Check this shit out. Like, that's 
That's awesome, man. I know the gold aura kind of ruins it, but if you zoom in enough, you don't really see it. Yeah, that actually, that looks cool, man. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I love it. So let's go ahead and go Kyle Ken, because he should be able to go Kyle Ken. I just want to make sure that it will work, because I didn't test it out. Yeah, he even says it too. All right. I, okay, maybe this is just my opinion. Y'all let me know down in the comments. I think this one looks the best, okay? The one step further, where it's like, I guess like times 10 or whatever, is too, too much red, okay? And his hair turns like gray or something. It's weird. But this one right here, where it's like slightly, slightly almost like a, a, it's a very nice color. I don't know what it is. Like the cyan, like almost turquoise color is really, really cool. Now let's go ahead and check out Vegeta here because he's pretty fun, okay? So this is like, you know, normal Vegeta and stuff. I think he's got a little bit of uh, some weird move set or whatever. I think this is, um... yeah, he's got some like extra strength. Maybe that's the SSBE move set or whatever. I can't even remember what Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta's moveset was, but I mean, that one's kind of cool, right? It's a little bit glitchy. So uh, I gave him Raid Blast. Whoa, hold on. Oh, okay. So this one he really is not supposed to have. I think it's because that's the God Vegeta one and not the CAC one. He gets all glitched out. But that's kind of weird looking, bro. It looks, <laughs> it looks like he's, he's banging him, bro. Hold on. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that looks so wrong. Let me see. Whoa, hold on. Burstinger looks sick. Did you see that? It's a Gallic gun. That actually looks hella cool. It gets really fucked up, but that looks awesome. Okay. I fuck with that, dude. He does like a shockwave, and then he does like a Gallic gun that goes below. It descends? That's weird. Let me see Wild Buster. Oh, that would actually look really good. That looks really good on Blue Vegeta. I love that, dude. One more time. The angle. Look at his face. What's up, Doc, motherfucker? Like, what the hell? <laughs> that is hella cool, dude. Like, it's weird because it glitched out, but stuff worked really nice. Like, I, I don't know, man. Final Shine. Final Shine, I think, would work really well. Because it is kind of like a bluish, like, greenish. It almost looks like it's like Gamma Burst Flash. If it was like a greenish kind of color. Oh, that'd be so sick, dude. I like it. Um, Burning Strike might not... Oh, oh, wait. It works! Let's go. I feel like Burning Strike would be good, too. That's from Trunks. So I mean, it's like, you know, Vegeta gets some Trunks skills would be pretty cool. All right, let's go and try out the transformation here. This one's dope. Okay, so this one is custom. It uses the evolved transformation from CAC, but it's been like more slowed down and cinematic. Oh, that's so cool. So big shout out to Zero for making this one. This one's dope, dude. And it does actually change the move set. It goes to, um, I just put on regular Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta like move set and stuff. I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, we have Gallic Gun and everything, which he has final Gallic Flash, I think, like normally. Which is such a weird skill, but it's cool because it's just like a combo with Super Gallic Gun integrated into it, which is dope. Um, here's Super Gallic Gun, just basic. Which this one's cool because I mean, it's like you can charge it up, but I know he already has the Final Gallic Flash or whatever the fuck it was called. But um, normally he doesn't have Final Flash, if I recall correctly, his Final Explosion. So Final Flash would be nice to have, okay? Um, I definitely think that the Super Saiyan Blue versions of Goku and Vegeta need a custom partner. Um, in terms of the skill changes and stuff, but it's not like, oh shit, like I, I need this, you know, so badly to the point where when you actually get it, they're going to be OP. Like Goku, blue Goku on his own is really good. Like <laughs> just imagine how broken he's going to be, right? So yeah, I mainly wanted to just have these two boys next to each other because of, you know, the new Dragon Ball Legends shit, but let's go ahead and get into the Beast Gohan because that one is going to be really fun. All right, so I wanted to have an all-in-one transforming Beast Gohan, but a lot of stuff was not cooperating with me. Like, honestly, it gets super messed up. Um, I think if we got DBS Superhero Gohan, I'd really like for him to have Super Saiyan. It's kind of annoying that this file, like these files for the colors and everything, it's just basically potential Unleash Recolor. That's all it is, right? Um, those files exist. They're actually left in the game. 
but they never use it. So I don't know if that's the thing that's like planned or whatever, but it would be nice, right? To have, you know, at least all his forms. He does it in the movie. It was a pretty significant part of, in the movie. So it's kind of annoying that he doesn't actually do it, but... This one created by ManQ is really nice. It uses all the custom animations, and it looks awesome. And the thing I love the most about this is, as you can see, there is a big difference between these. Um, I know most people like not having dipped in oil look, but it does at least, you know, match with the other transformations. Every other, like, major, like, big transformation for certain characters like SSB Vegeta or, like, UI Goku all has that dipped in oil look. So it's just kind of weird that Beast Gohan doesn't normally have that, right? But um, the problem with it is it gets, I think, glitched out. Let me actually... Yeah! Yeah! Look! Bro! Gohan! Dude, Gohan! This is his true final form. Look at the bang! I better not hear anybody bitch about Gohan's bang anymore. Because this shit is a straight-up sword, bro. Beast Gohan actually had a blade this whole time. Look at this. <laughs> oh my god oh my god where is bro's dick it disappeared what is oh look at the sword look how Oh my goodness. It literally looks like a blade, bruh. The color of it and everything, it looks like a massive sword. Hold on, we gotta see this shit, bro. <laughs> New video idea. How how powerful is Gohan's bang? How powerful is Beast Gohan's bang right here, right now? Oh my god. Oh, does that go infinitely? It does! His pants go infinite! Unlimited power up into the air. So, yeah, that was, um, that's why I didn't use that Gohan. <laughs> I just wanted to show the transformation animation. That's basically all, right? So, let's try Heroic Assault. Um, that one does work. Hopefully. Yeah, it's working good. Alright, that's dope. Oh my goodness, like, it's everything was so glitchy with this version of Gohan. I think it's because the one for Man-Q, it wasn't, you weren't supposed to change the skills on it, but that was the only way I could do it. So, Heroic Assault, um, mini special beam cannon, I think would be kind of cool on him, if we had, like, a custom partner Gohan. Um, Justice Kick actually looks really good. I don't know about the red blast or whatever at the end, but the, the swirling purple kick actually works out really, really good. I just tried to get some, like, justice, hero, you know, heroic-based stuff for Beast Gohan. Just, you know, that's how he is, right? He's Gohan. Um, we got Spirit Slash or normal shit there. Is this the... Okay, this is the teleporting one. Dope, dope, dope. Uh, that gets glitched out. I had a feeling some something would get glitched out on him. Yeah, I think that's the wrong ultimate charge, but... Um, we do have... Let's see here. Let me see. What happens if I go Beast again? This is the one that kills him, right? I like that he does a smirk. Yeah, now he dies. <laughs> yeah, I love I love the glitches, man. I'd rather not have them, but it, it's fun sometimes. So, the shot sign of Awakening. Um, I don't know why I did this one. Just because I wanted to have, like, a cooler-looking Kamehameha. Uh, Super Kamehameha is so boring. Like, let's be real. We see it all the time. So, this is basically a cooler version of it, right? Now for the one we were waiting for. Will it work? Father, son, Kamehameha. Nope! Nope! His eyes get cockeyed. But that does look pretty cool with Goku in the back. So, yeah, in conclusion, my boy Gohan is very upset. <laughs> does it at least correct itself at some point? No, it just stays like that. And I think I know why that's the case, because Beast Gohan has very, very, very unique facial features and animations. So that's probably why it's it's glitching out in his eyes especially. But hey, it does, I mean, at least work. It just messes up the, the facial animation. So there you have it, man. Um, I think a custom Beast Gohan would go pretty hard. I would love to have just more custom characters in general. Like I said, comment down below what you would like to see. And, uh, you know, maybe I'll do some more in the future. Like, subscribe, ring my notification bell. Yes, it's my turn. Peace out.
<laughs> this is Broly, and you are watching Slow Plays. Make sure to subscribe, or else I'll destroy your entire planet. <laughs>